uh, we're doing the white belt self-defense combinations. Uh, so for the white belt ranking self-defense, uh, Mr. Murray can start with a diagonal wrist grab. The idea is I'm going to step in and do a low block. Uh, with kids especially, we really emphasize taking a big step on it. The hand comes up to the ear. When you're doing the low block, think about it as if you're going into the radial. You're doing more of a, of a smash into the radial and you're pulling your other hand away. So there's got to be two actions with it to pull it away. From here with the range, I'm going to reverse punch. Back leg is going to come up, front kick, go right back down behind me. We try and get in the habit of ending all self-defense with double stepping and return. Okay. So again, I'm going to step in, I'm going to low block, counter reverse punch, hands up, front kick, and double step away. For number two, uh, Mr. Marik is doing a, a double hand punch shoulder grab, and we're doing what we call a, a swimming technique. All right, I'll do it on both sides so that the, the arm comes up over the top of his arm, under the other side, and it's going to be straight up and down, so that way I can slap my hands together, and as I do so, I'm going to rotate my shoulder and step back here. Okay, based on my range, I'm going to pick up my lead leg side kick, slide in with a back fist, double step, and return. So now if I do it on the other side, again, it's just swimming because up and out of the waves, up and over the water, coming over and under, palms up. I slap as I step back to clear my distance, side kick, back fist, double step, and return. So for self-defense three and four, uh, those are based off your combative self-defense, and that's a rotating cycle. So you're going to need to know which set you are doing, and then you're going to go find the video that says self-defense combatives either sets one, two, or three, and that'll wrap up your self-defense.